Dental x-rays have come a long way through history. Um, as of now, because of digital x-rays and all the technologies that's developed, the radiation that's emitted by dental x-rays is very minimal. And a lot of times in pediatric dentistry, we don't usually take them unless there is a need for it. So the first set of x-rays we usually take is called a max occluso. That usually takes a picture of kids' upper teeth. That usually looks for, you know, if there's any pathology in the area, any extra tooth, are the permanent teeth present? Um, and unless we're following like a trauma or something specific, we don't routinely retake these on a regular basis. Other x-ray that's routinely taken is called a bite wing radiograph. That's the one that takes a picture of their back teeth when they, once they start to touch. That's kind of the only way to detect cavities that develop between the teeth. So when we look with our eyes, we can see smooth surface caries, which means if it's on the chewing surface or the side that touches their cheek, the only side that you can't see with your eyes is where the teeth touch, and that's called an interproximal caries if they develop. And usually that's from, you know, eating a lot of snacks and not big fans of flossings and things getting stuck there for a long time, slowly developing into cavities. And bite wing x-rays are the only way to detect it. So, the, you know, this is like our only way of telling if they have this type of cavities. Usually kids back teeth don't start to touch until about age three, three and a half. So we don't usually start taking these until we see signs of close contacts. And then around age seven or eight, whenever their permanent front teeth come in, we take what we call a panoramic x-ray and that takes a picture of their jaw, their baby teeth, adult teeth, everything all in one picture. This one is more so for you know growth and development. Are they missing any teeth? How are the permanent teeth looking? The angle of things coming in, do they need an early ortho console or are we okay to wait?